first at four. One website run in Palm Beach County is covering major national news. Thanks for staying with us. I'm Meredith McDonough. Well, most recently, Radar Online has been on top of New York Congressman's sex scandal. Terry Parker has live coverage from our studio with an inside look. Terry? Lindsay, Mel, Arnold, and now Wiener. Radar Online trumpets online exclusives on the big entertainment stories every week, and it's run out of an office in Boca Raton. The editor-in-chief has a long history in journalism, from the Washington Post to the National Enquirer. So I interviewed him today to find out how they get the exclusive scoops on the stories everyone is talking about. Yeah, it's a frenzied atmosphere. It's news reporting, and it's entertainment news reporting. So at times, yes, it's very intense. It's because you know you're in a race against other news organizations. So you have to do things right, and you have to do them fast. David Perel runs both Star Magazine and Radar Online here in Boca Raton. The website's only two years old, but already scoring impressive scoops. We were the first to reveal who Arnold Schwarzenegger's housekeeper was, the mother of his love child. And, of course, the Anthony Weiner scandal. Ah, the Anthony Weiner scandal. Radar first revealed the sexy text messages between Weiner and a woman, exactly the type of story that fuels 24-hour-a-day hits. You know, if we can bring them exclusive photos and exclusive video, it's great. It's stuff you can't get anywhere else. It's he just issued an apology? I saw that. So. Radar Online employs about 30 people here and in Los Angeles, plus freelancers. So how do they come up with so many exclusives? I asked Perel if they pay people for stories. Well, not really a subject that you could talk about um, that vaguely, but bottom line is we license material just like the networks do. If somebody has photographs, if somebody has video footage and they bring it to us, um, you know, it just depends. But basically most of the information we get is just from good, hardcore reporting, going out there, door knocking, calling people up. And he says they are careful to vet everything before it goes online, sometimes losing a story by waiting to make sure it's true. You know, the number one goal is get the story right because we know we're going to get our fair share of exclusives. So what's the big exclusive they're chasing down now? More Wienergate. There's some more twists to this story that uh, we can't talk about right now, but we hope to have up on the site uh, next week um, if things go well. Back when Perel was the editor of the National Enquirer, he broke the John Edwards Mistra story, a giant scoop that has now culminated in the former presidential candidate being indicted. Now he's running both the Star Tabloid and Radar Online and trying to make them both successful. Reporting live in the studio, Terry Parker, WPVF 25 News. A child on the Treasure Coast is recovering in the hospital after being bitten.